I got a box in the mail. Um, this is the Culture Fly World's Finest Collection. This is the Winter 2021 box, the Titans box, if you will. Um, now, I was pretty down. I haven't gotten a World's Finest since I think the spring. I was really, really down, real negative about the Flashpoint box. Um, I don't even remember if I posted the video about that here. Um, I really, really, really did not like it. Um, had nothing but negative things to say about it. So I, I'm almost positive I didn't post it. But, but I got the winter box last year and it had this dope green arrow hoodie in it. And I loved that hoodie so much. I wear this thing all the time. I get complimented, compliments on it a lot. Um, it's just, it's comfortable. It's it's got really cool colors. I love it. I love this hoodie so much. Uh, when culture, when world's finest collection, uh, culture fly releases new boxes, they will do spoilers on their Instagram page. They had a spoiler. <laughs> they had a spoiler for this box. Um, normally they post a bunch of spoilers and then the boxes eventually go out. These boxes went out pretty quickly cause they're trying to get them out for Christmas. Um, they posted a spoiler for this box it's another hoodie. Uh, after the fiasco that was the the Flashpoint box, oh, I thought, oh, do I do it? Black Friday, they had a buy one, get one sale. So I was like, you know what? Let's take a chance. I want that hoodie so badly. I'm willing to pay just for that hoodie. Let's do it. So we got the box. I have another box coming from them that's free. I don't know what that's going to be. It's going to be another World's Finest box. Um, I just don't know which one it'll be. With my luck, it'll be the Flashpoint box. Um, uh, as you can see, I got another cat. Um, meet uh, Princess Kara Zor-El. Uh, she is the last daughter of Krypton. Uh, she is also uh, commonly known as Winkerbell or Mary Todd Winkin. Uh, that's right, I have a one-eyed cat. Whatever. Uh, she's great, but she's absolute chaos. Uh, so I got two cats now. The chances for butthole in this video are doubled. How great is that? Don't press buttons. Bro, don't press buttons. You got to respect the camera, bro. You got to respect the camera. All right, let's crack this open. Um, I was trying to record this video. I got to unwrapping the plastic and my camera died because I don't know what's going on. But uh, yeah, anyways. Culture Fly, these World's Finest boxes, these, the boxes are great looking. And this is a heavy box. I don't recall the other two boxes being this heavy. This is a heavy, heavy box. Um, but yeah, the, the Culture Fly boxes are great. Um, a guy in my building saw this and was like, what is that? Um, so yeah, very cool looking. I need you to get off of the box. Thank you. All right, let's... Take a look and see what's inside. Okay, I don't want to look because I want to I want to be surprised by what's in the box. Even though I know that that hoodie's in the box and I know the figure. Well, the figure, when they post on their website, like, what's kind of going to be in the box, they'll post little f silhouettes of the items in the box. And every time they post it with the figure, y you, you can tell. <laughs> like, you can absolutely tell who it is. Uh, like, there was a Batman box a couple of months ago and it was very clearly a penguin figurine. Like you could see the silhouette, like top hat, the, you know, the more round, whatever. Uh, anyways, so based off of this one, I knew what it was before they even posted the spoiler. Um, because yeah, you can, you'll, you'll see. But anyways, the first item are beast boy socks. Uh, they got toes. I don't know how I feel about that. But this fabric is incredible. This is soft. You can, I mean, you can almost kind of see. It's like, um, like bathrobe kind of material. It's very cushy and soft and kind of thick. These are some great, great winter socks right here. I don't know how I feel about the toesy toes. Um, I don't think I've ever worn toe socks before. Um, but I loves me some, uh, warm socks. There was Lupin. Okay. All right. So let's see what we can do. So, all right. I can see the hoodie. 
Uh, let's grab this. This, I think, is the pin. Jeez, oh my good lord. This is... This is the pin. Um... Look at that. Look how, look how big this thing is. Look how, look how big this thing is. Look how thick. It is a Starfire gem pin. And this thing is huge. Good lord. That's huge. Um, I, 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 I don't know what to think of this. It's kind of gunked on it. There's, I don't know if that's gunk or if that's broken, but... Uh, this is cool, I guess. I don't know. Um, it's huge. It's a cool looking pin. It's got rubber backs, which I love. Um, I don't know. This is this is so dumb that I kind of love it. It's huge. This is a huge pin. That is a huge freaking pin. Oh my god. All right, I think this is the figure. So let's grab that because I I know what the figure is. The figure. You'll see if I can grab it. The figure was very obvious what it was going to be because of who is on it. Yeah. Oh, there we go. It's wedged in there. Okay, yeah. So, Ms. Nightwing. Um, the, 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 these figures are... Eh, eh. The problem with Culture Fly is, like, I know, Culture Fly, I know that your stuff is cheap, but, like, they don't try to make it not look cheap. Like, Funkos are cheap, but, like, they try. So they try to make them look like they're not super cheap. Uh, Culture Fly, they're like, meh. Meh. You can buy the box. Um, so the Thomas Wayne from the Flashpoint box, that, that, pop, that, that figure was so awful. It was like a cheap ripoff of the McFarlane um, Thomas Wayne. I, I hated it so much. I hated it so much. This is... Oh my... This is fantastic. Look at this. Oh my goodness. As awful as that Thomas Wayne was, this is magnificent. I was kind of thinking I was going to give this away to someone. The paint job's not great. But this is this is a really good looking figure. Like, wow. This is fantastic. This is absolutely fantastic. The The Thomas Wayne one, again, I don't know if I posted the video, but the Thomas Wayne one, it was very clearly a, a McFarlane ripoff, but, like, to the point where it had articulating arms and legs, like the McFarlane uh, figure, but it was just a, a, a solid mold of plastic. So it's like, why do you need articulation in your legs, arms, and joints if you're not moving? Doesn't make any sense. All right, let's grab another item here. This box, I can't this box. What is, it? what is this? Let's grab it. All right. This is... Oh! Okay, 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 okay. I love this. This is a Teen Titans Bento box. Um, I guess Bento is like a... Um, like a lunchbox kind of thing, but it's like a segmented... It's an Asian thing, maybe Japanese. I don't know for sure. I don't want to say it is Japanese because I don't know that for certain. But um, So this is kind of like a lunchbox. Oh, this is so cool. So it's got the Titans uh, on there. Oh, little handle. Uh, it's got the Titans. Very cool artwork on there. Um, paint job's not great, but it's actually painted on there. It's not like a piece of paper or something like that that's stuck to it. All right, let's see. We got... Uh, so we can take this open. Comes off. Uh, you got a top segment, and then it's yeah. So it's like a segmented lunchbox. Um, that is pretty cool. That is really. It's got these awesome handles. So it's yeah. This is kind of cool. This is a cheap plastic lunchbox, but. It looks cool. Like, this is what you need to be doing, Culture Fly. This is, this is not, I wouldn't pay more than five bucks for this, but it's cool looking. Like, it, I like this. I like this a lot. I'm not into, super into Teen Titans, but I like this lunchbox. I like this bento box. This is, this is what your stuff needs to be, Culture Fly. You have it in you. Do it. All right. So let's see what's next. All right. There's another box. I couldn't get out. What else is there? 
There's the spoiler card. I think that's it. I think it's just a box. Maybe like there's some stickers or something on the bottom. All right, let's see what this box is. Oh, oh, oh. so we have a Raven heat activated mug. So as you can see, uh, that's what it would look like as just a regular mug. That's what it's going to look like when it's got heat on it. Um, I'm not going to pour anything into it because I really don't feel like doing that, but I'd like to look at it at least. Um, because again, I like to see what the quality is because, yeah, like, like I said, the, it, this is all cheap stuff, but it doesn't have to look cheap. You know, I want something that looks cool. I don't care if it's cheap. I don't care if it's super expensive, but make it look good. So let's see. It's a smaller mug. Um, okay. I like this. It's, it's chipped. That's a bummer. It's chipped. Um, but it's a nice, nice design. Very cool. The heat activated stuff isn't super, um, like you can't really, it just kind of looks like it's part of her cape. You really can't tell that there's extra stuff there. If you look closely, you can tell, but uh, you'd have to look at it. Sometimes with these heat-changing mugs, you can just tell that there's stuff there, and it looks really, really bad. This is it. This is a. This is another good item. This box is crushing it, and we haven't even gotten to the thing that I want. The reason I got this box, and it's already like a fantastic box. This is maybe I'll maybe I'll maybe I'll get the next box. I don't know what the theme is. They haven't released that yet. Um, that'll come out probably in like March or April. Um, all right. All right. I think the only other item in here is, oh, there's one other thing. What's this? There's one other thing, I think. Oh, there's two things. Let's grab this one first. Okay. This is Nightwing Chopsticks. Okay. Um, I don't know how to use chopsticks, but maybe I needed the right... Okay, so it's it's a cheap plastic, and it's got, you can see, like, the, again, you know, but you're not going to see that part because it's going to be kind of put up in here, right? So you won't really see that. So I'm going to give it, I'm going to give it a pass on that. And so I guess, oh, I see. So this helps you, oh, that's kind of neat. Um, it's very cheap. It's very flimsy. Um, I think... If somebody wanted this as a collector's piece, it's pretty cool. I don't think it's very durable for use, but um, the plastic seems... Well, the plastic doesn't seem super flimsy. Um, it's not great. It's not It's not great, but it's, it's okay. It's all right. This is probably the worst item in the box so far, and that's... This is filler. So I'm not mad at that. I am absolutely not mad at that. All right. I think there's one other thing in the box, and then the hoodie. All right, let's see. Yeah, there's the spoiler card, and then there's this. Uh, it's like a like an art print. It's Beast Boy and Raven. Um, eh, it's fine. It's fine. It's nothing exciting. Nothing to write home about. All right, all that's left is the. What is it? Okay, so the inside of the box is super cool looking. Where's the spoiler card? What happened to the spoiler card? Sorry. Okay, so. Did I put the spoiler card somewhere? There was a spoiler card here somewhere. Okay, anyways. Uh, so maybe there's no spoiler card. We have the hoodie. It's the same fabric. Guys, it's the same fabric. It's so soft. It's so comfy. It's thin, but it's not like super, super thin. Um, I love this color of gray. I love both colors of the gray. I love the orange and the blue. And then on the back, we've got... Yeah, 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 yeah. I am super excited for this. This is great. The cat is in the box. Oh, that's great. This is awesome. This is super, super cool. Um, love this hoodie. I'm going to wear this a lot. Uh, I'm already going to wear, you know, 
yeah, uh, so I got this box based off of the hoodie. Everything else was a win to begin with, but, like, that hoodie is just exceptional. All right, so just to recap, we did get this, um, this print. Worst thing in the box, by far, this print. Cheap, uh, kind of cool looking. Um, if you're into uh, Titans, if you're into Beast Boy and Raven, um, this might be something you'd like. It's not, it's not great. Pretty cheap. The chopsticks, second not great thing in the box, but a cool little collector's item if you're super into whatever. Uh, next, I would probably go with, actually, I would probably go with, oh, I don't know. Um, I'd go with this awful <laughs> pin. Uh, it's cool, but it's it's too big. This is just, it's too big. It's dumb. It's too stupid big. Um, next up, I think, oh, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, because everything is kind of uneven. Oh, there's, okay, it was stuck to this. Um, yeah. So yeah, that's just an art print. That's, there's nothing else to that. Okay. It doesn't say what the next box is. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I would rank the next ones. Let's go with, um, let's go with the bento box. It's, it's, it's real cheap plastic. Um, but it's, it's, it's not super, it, it looks it's cheap plastic, but it doesn't look super cheap. Like, it looks pretty cool. And for what it's supposed to do, it, it's probably pretty fantastic. Like, um, yeah, I, I like the little handle. Um, yeah, but we'll put that next. Um, then I think, God, am I going to do it? Uh, we'll do the socks next. Um, so that was the, yeah. Uh, and then I think I got it. I think the, I think the, the mug. Next, uh, in the line of the best things in this box. And then the hoodie is obviously number one. But number two, I'm going to go with this Nightwing figurine. This thing is, the paint job isn't isn't great, but it's, the, the, the mold is really good looking. The mold is really good looking. Um, and the paint doesn't betray it. The face... The face is clean. The lines are clean on the face. There's no bleed from the mask or the ear or the, 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 you know, the hair and the skin don't bleed into each other. The, the, the clothing doesn't bleed into the skin. This thing is a win. This is a fantastic figurine. Um, yeah, this is amazing. This is an absolute, compared to what the Thomas Wayne one was, even the Supergirl one. I really like the Supergirl one that I got uh, last year. And, and this is by far and away better. But the number one item is this hoodie. This hoodie is amazing. Uh, the Culture Fly uh, World's Finest Collection, the clothing in this stuff is amazing. These socks look super cool. This hoodie, this hoodie, um, the Thomas Wayne Batman logo from the Flashpoint box. I love that. I love that long sleeve shirt. Um, so check it out if you're interested in DC related products. Also on Culture Fly, they've got The Office, which I'm thinking about. Uh, they've got Star Wars now. They've got Friends. Um, they've got a bunch of different boxes on there, just regular Culture Fly as well, um, that you can see and subscribe to or just buy one box. Uh, if this is this box was worth it for the hoodie for me. Everything else was a win. Uh, you know, I mean, with the exception of these two things. But even this, I, I know somebody who will love this. So I'm going to give that to them. And this thing is going to be, they're going to love this. They're going to love this. This, um, I could probably give this to a child. And they would also love it. So win, win, win. All right. So that's the World's Finest Collection Fall, Winter. Does it say? It doesn't really say. This is the Winter Box, the Titans theme. Win absolute win um gosh man yeah culture fly you knocked it out of the park this is fantastic this is a great box uh if you're interested um you can go to worldsfinestcollection.com and you can sign up for the next box this box is sold out um but the at the beginning of the year i think the next box should go live they haven't said what it is yet but it might be worth checking out if you're interested in dc comics or just comic book stuff in general this is probably a good one. I'm, I'm not a Green Arrow fan. I'm not a huge Deathstroke fan, but I love these hoodies. So, did you guys, could you guys tell that I love the hoodies? 
So anyway, so thanks for watching. Uh, I'll probably review that next box. Uh, we'll see what it is, and we'll take a look. Uh, that should be coming later in the week, so I'll get to it when I get a chance. I had to open this and get this hoodie. All right, thanks, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.